I'm Mark Powers for This Old House Magazine. A cedar bench supported by two sturdy planters is a great way to incorporate both seeding and colorful container plants into your landscape. To get started, cut all the pieces using a stop block secured to the table to make sure all your planter boards come out equal. Because end grain will be featured in this project, be sure to clean up all your ends on new 2x4s before making your actual cut. Since you'll use the seat frame to position the planters, assemble it first by securing stringers between the long front and back boards. Lay the frame in place on the ground and position a level along its length. Stack 2x4 boards under the low end of the frame until it's level. The number of stacked 2x4s under the low end of the frame will be the number of additional courses you'll need to add to the downhill planter to create two level planters for the seat frame. Set the seat frame on edge and position the outline of each planter near the ends. Make each outline by arranging four boards in a pinwheel brick pattern. Remove the seat frame and use a garden spade to mark the outline of each planter. Excavate about six inches of soil from each bed, keeping the walls plumb and the bottom level. Add a two inch layer of gravel to each bed, tamp it down, and keep adding layers until you're two inches below ground level. Add an additional half inch layer of sand or potting soil to make it easier to level the first courses. Position the first course on each bed and use the seat frame to make sure they're square to each other. Set a level across each course and use a hammer to level and set each board into the gravel bed. Apply construction adhesive on the top boards and lay a second course on each planter positioned in the opposite direction to overlap the joints. Screw the second course into the first course and then drill pilot holes down through the middle of each side of each planter. Drive a long spike through each pilot hole to anchor the first two courses and create a sturdy base. Continue erecting the planters using construction adhesive between each course and galvanized nails to hold the pieces in place. Set the seat frame on the planters and construct inner frames that are flush with the inside walls of the planters using 2x4s set on edge. Attach the inner frames to the seat frame and planters and add an additional stringer alongside the tall planter, but not quite touching it. Next, add the remaining courses of the tall planter on top of the seat frame. Attach the seat boards to the seat frame, leaving a slight gap between the boards. Use a jigsaw to cut the seat boards flush with the inside walls of the shorter planter to create its opening. Miter the ends of four cap pieces at 45 degrees using a circular saw and then fasten them to the top of the tall planter. Now fill the planters with gravel topped off with potting soil and plant your favorite bloomers to enjoy from your new bench seat.